Today I have another wild study on pain and empathy, and this one is just, you gotta see it. They had a bunch of college students take acetaminophen, standard painkiller you buy anywhere. And they had a control group take a placebo with no painkiller, and neither group knew what they got. Then they had them play a virtual game of toss the ball around, and they think that the other players are actual people, but they're just computers. At one point they watched three other players toss the ball around for a while, and then suddenly player one and player three start tossing it just between the two of them and leaving out player two. This is very sad and embarrassing for player two because they want to play too. Well, afterwards, they asked everyone how much empathy they felt for the player that was excluded, and lo and behold, the people who got acetaminophen felt less empathy. But this goes deeper. In a second experiment, they had the participants read a story where the main character experienced something physically painful, like stepping on a thumbtack or slamming their fingers in a door, or something socially painful, like overhearing someone else say that they don't like them. Again, afterwards, the group given acetaminophen reported feeling less personal distress when reading these stories. So acetaminophen not only reduces pain, it seems to be reducing empathy for pain. Wild stuff. I love science. Follow for more cool papers.